again to the class of uh, shortwave diatomy as uh, been said to do a video class of uh, construction and working principle of shortwave diatomy I'm starting with the construction of shortwave diatomy circuit since this looks a pretty uh, complicated circuit at least for, for the students who is uh, looking for the very first time um, to any kind of circuit from the electrotherapy perspective so what I have decided is uh, we will have few different classes of video uh, one is the construction so we will try to understand the how to draw or how to understand the circuit the uh, second part will be basically how this circuit works so today we will talk only about the construction of shortwave diatherm one of the high frequency currents so let's start up from the left side of the circuit so if we see from the left side of the circuit uh, there are two transformers so let, let's try to avoid this part first of all let's uh, start from the left side of the circuit so if you see from here uh, so this is a transformer the primary coil and the primary coil over here so there are two primary coils over here so the primary coils as I said earlier also are always connected by the AC current so the secondary coil is never ever connected to the any kind of AC current while only the primary coils will be connected to the AC current there are two transformers one is a step down transformer the another one is a step up transformer as it has been written in the uh, diagram also so step down means the number of coils are less here while here the number of coils will be more so if we see from the top now from the left left one we have uh, completed and uh, one more important aspect of the circuit is the whole circuit is basically divided into two categories one is a machine circuit and one is a patient circuit so here if we see from the end this is the patient circuit that is this one E and F coil so this area is a patient circuit while this area so that is CD C and D coil is hold as a machine circuit so coming back again from the starting there are two, two primary coils and two transformers so the step down transformer if we look it into this then it is uh, connected to an filament or also called as triode filament and this filament is getting heated we will talk about the working later on then it is connected to a grid valve and this is a vacuum area and then a plate and not plate is connected to a coil and the coil is CD and then this coil is again getting connected to the step up transformer so this is the basic and nearby there is one more coil that is AB what is the role of this we will talk in the working and another coil EF has been put up so two coils AB and EF has been put near to the CD what are their roles we will uh, come to know into the working uh, principle of the shortwave diathermy and uh, finally in these two pads of the patient circuit uh, and in between the tissue will be the in between these two pads so it's pretty easy don't get uh, complicated uh, by looking at this diagram uh, understand this the whole diagram can be taken up into two parts from the left side again transformer and this one is from step down transformer step up transformer connected to a grid triode filament and two three circuits over here what are the role of these two three circuits we will come to know into the next working principle